Camp Facer. What's going on campers camp facer here today's video we are reviewing the new texas chainsaw massacre collector edition i bought i bought this one at fye and i own this movie already but i'm a sucker for uh steel case collector edition um dvd blu-ray 4k this comes in 4k as well um i wasn't gonna pick it up but then i thought to myself i looked at it, it said it's a limited edition you guys so if you're into texas chainsaw massacre and steel case um it, it's a limited run so i highly suggest you guys go pick it up um it's it is kind of pricey it's uh 29.99 30 um but i had to get it and i'm going to talk about it for here for a second uh now on the on the front this is the uh image you get which is really cool i really like this image that is a really that can make for a really cool poster. I like that artwork a lot. I like it when um, films franchises do like they new artwork um, instead of just kind of re pasting, copying and pasting like, the original um, artwork. Uh, I like it also when they they give you the option to reverse the sleeve to either the original cover or the new art. That's a really good touch. But in this case, it's a steel case, so th it is what it is right there. Um, now on the back, on the, um, the cardboard insert that it came, you got the, um, the details, uh, the bonuses, and all that good stuff there. Um, maybe you could pause that and read it later, if it can, if it can focus. Um, it's got the chainsaw right here coming around. I th thought that was pretty cool. But then, you know, when you open it up and take off the sleeve, you get just the chainsaw, which is kind of... Uh, I, I would have rather to leave all the content on the back of the um, steel book, in my opinion. But I mean, it is cool. It's it's like the simple, you know. I get it. But um, the spine is really cool because it looks like there's some you could pull a, a a book or a DVD out of there. You know what I mean? It's that's a really cool spine. It's got the curved corners. Um, yeah, it just says Texas Chainsaw Massacre. And then on this side of the spine, where you open it up, the chainsaw wraps around. Um, so yeah, I mean, I really like these collector editions a lot. So let's open it up, and here's where, here's where my opinion changes. Here, okay, you guys. Now on the inside, when you open it up, it clicks open. You get the move the the, the disc, which is the cover, which is okay. All right, I. They could have changed up the, the image on the disc a little bit. Maybe had a gory scene or something like that. But this is what really bothers me. I mean, I'm going to take out the disc. And put the disc to the side. This is what really bothers me about this edition. What, what are we looking at here? What are we all looking at? Nothing, right? Black? Nothing. Nothing. Absolutely Nothing. <laughs> I don't know, you guys. I don't know about that. <sighs> Hold on a second. I'm going to open it again. Also, inside here, what are we looking at un under these tabs that, that usually hold stuff in there? What are we looking at? There's nothing there. <sighs> For $30 and, and, and to, to put out a special edition, limited edition, Steelbook Collector, remastered in, in 4K, bonus features, all that stuff... That's the, obviously the content is what we're looking for, but as a collector, how come they didn't put any kind of images on the inside underneath the plastic, like something, anything, to, to put just nothing but black? And then some editions, some collector editions have like a little extra like, um, like, comic book type thing or like a photo book of the uh, stills from the movies <laughs> something fun to look at it it didn't come for 30 dollars. it didn't come with anything to me that's a little disappointing i don't know um 
do am I am I really all that upset about it? No, because I do love the fact that I got my hands on this copy. I'm just trying to criticize for people that might look forward to that kind of stuff when they open it up. I know there's going to be a lot of disappointed people that are going to, you know, same thing. Um, they could have, they could have put something in there, something, anything. Uh, they could have put a map of, of the, the, where the killing happened in the house in Texas. And, um, you know, they could have did something fun for the, for the collectors out there. Um, anyways, that's just my two cents on it. I'm excited to still check out all the bonus features and, and, See what it looks like remastered. Um, I'm really excited about that. Uh, anyways, that's the video for today. I want to say thank you for watching. Please give it a like. Uh, please subscribe if you have not already. We do have new merch on, on the channel. I'll put the link down in the description below. We also have a link on our header um, to the store. Uh, new merch. Can't, and we got stickers right here. We got the Camp Facer stickers. Everything's on the merch store. Um, yeah, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. And as always, campers, stay out of the woods.